Workers. They're weak. They lack discipline. They lack commitment. General, I know there's been a glitch or two, but everybody is working full tilt as it is, and... You can't help it. It's your nature. But in spite of your limitations, you are going to finish this tunnel on schedule. Come hell or high water. From now on, anyone who falls behind is going to have to personally explain themselves to Colonel Cutter. And let me assure you, the Colonel is not as understanding as I am. Dismissed. Four more days, Cutter. Four more days. And we can bid final farewell to their kind of incompetence. Yes, sir. A fresh start. Imagine it. A strong colony, sir. A colony we can be proud of. Yes, but we're not there yet. Cutter, we just got word that a termite army has mobilized against us. Against us? We'll have to send troops deep into hostile territory to attack their colony. Attack a termite colony, sir? That's suicide. Exactly. Do you have the list I ask for? Yes, General. These are the units loyal to the Queen. Hmm. Then they're the ones we'll be sending. It's a shame. There's some fine officers here. Don't we need the Queen's approval to declare war? Our very next stop, Cutter. General, we've been at peace with that colony for years. Why would they attack us? They want our land. They're desperate for more foraging territory. Perhaps they think we've grown soft or weak. Why don't we dispatch an ambassador? Negotiate a new treaty. Certainly we don't need to send soldiers. Believe me, every ant in this colony is so precious to me. Uh, that's why we must strike now. We have the element of surprise. If the termite shock troops enter our colony, well... Yes, General. 